matter to me You're not what they want you to be You're free You're free Hello everyone for the next presentation of reverse engineering the Golden Dawn system of magic we're going to take a little bit of, of a break from the from the rational mind and we're going to do a little meditation that's going to help us with future presentations uh, we've been focusing on the analytical aspects of magic and now I'd like to take a little break from all of that and do a little walking meditation. Now I want you to go out and take a walk and it would help if you are on a road that doesn't really change very much because what we're going to do is what I like to call the conveyor belt meditation. I came up with this meditation over a quarter of a century ago, um, smoking a little bit of weed, taking a walk to the store to purchase a snack of some sorts. Um, and I found that as I was walking, I was able to imagine that I was walking on a conveyor belt. And so I was basically stationary and the scenery, the environment, was coming to me. In other words, I was bringing my environment to me based on the direction of my thoughts. And the direction of my thoughts were to arrive at a certain point, in this case, a store. Um, and as I walked, I would look at the ground in particular and I would visualize it as a conveyor belt. Now, it may help if you lift your feet up a certain way. I usually do it when I'm walking uh, to make myself feel more like I'm on a conveyor belt. Uh, this is a particularly good meditation because it helps you to visualize yourself as the center of the universe, your point of view, geometrically speaking. Um, as Crowley said, in an infinite universe, any point can be the center. To me. Not what they want you to be, you're free. You're free. 